Well, yeah, medal race, so beautiful breeze. Weymouth's delivered again. What a, what a fantastic. I think the foreigners can't believe it. Uh, you know, it's been just an amazing week for sailing. Uh, and, yeah, very tight race. Obviously, uh, you know, we were pretty tense going into it, very tight with a few boats and felt really we needed to be uh, delivering a medal at the end of this event, you know, on the Olympic waters. Yeah, tight race. We sailed pretty well, actually. Uh, certainly far from perfect, but given the situation, reasonable amount of pressure. You know, certainly felt pretty nervous when I woke up this morning. Uh, and uh, so, to, yeah, we held it together. We didn't certainly made no big mistakes. If we weren't perfect, we certainly weren't, you know, we certainly didn't make any massive errors. So, pretty happy. I think we finished third in the end, which is, uh, you know, good good race result. But it wasn't, it's never it's never all about your, your track position at the end. It's about your position relative to other people. And uh, and once the French guys and the Australians had a good start, then, you know, we were we were kind of fighting to just hang on to that bronze medal, really. And uh, I think we did a, yeah, I think we did a pretty good job. I was obviously pretty depressed that night, and it was a bit of a bit of a kick in the teeth. But uh, you know, we got a really strong team here, and and uh, and you know, we sort of were able to have a word with with our manager Sparky, and have a word with Ben Ainsley. You know, he was he did that at the Olympic Games. He got disqualified on the very first day, and you know, Ben's Ben, so he's it, we're, we're certainly far from him. But uh, he managed to deliver a gold medal after he disqualified on the first day, and uh, we've come up with a bronze medal. So I don't think that's uh, you know certainly got us along the right track. We've obviously you know we've been pushed. For as long as we've been sailing a 49 er a part of the British team, you know, Scandia Team GBR is blessed with uh, with a massive pool of talent. Obviously, only only three boats can win medals, and, and when you've got guys like Nathan Outridge from Australia, you know, and uh, Ian Jensen, who you know are, are, are very quick, sail very well, you know, are delivering medals as well, then there's even less space on the podium. So only uh, only a few can do well, and obviously we're we're very lucky to have done well here. Uh, although obviously we did plan to do well here, so maybe it's not totally luck.